Awesome, love it. Marlena, what's one of your passions? Line dancing. I like that. All right, line dancing. So when we talk about passions, one thing, I, I never line dance. It's like one of my things. I just, I will not wobble. I won't do any <laughs> line dances. Because, you know, I'm like, I can't get all the steps. And like, I, I, I pledged a frat, too. I couldn't step in my frat because I just couldn't get it all together. And then people get all fancy with it. They be adding a little extra steps. I'm like, oh, whatever. Anyway, so that's, again, that's just bonus. What was I even talking about? The passions. <laughs> well, your passions, you're tapping at people's passions are important because when people come to work, you want them excited about being at work. Think about how we might spend eight to 10 hours a day at work. You may spend up to an hour commuting one way uh, and an hour back, all the time you spend getting ready for work. You better have some, you want to be able to explore and, and, and release some of your passions at work. So if you're trying to really make it matter, make the job matter, make the workplace matter, find out what your team is passionate about. Find out what your people are passionate about and how you can all you know, work to make sure that at least at some time, you're able to tap into Not every day, look, it's work, okay? So we're not gonna come and have line dance Wednesdays every week, right? But you know that, hey, if, if, if Wade is planning the next event, Wade's gonna make plan a line dancing party, right? So those are the kind of things you wanna think about when we talk about value. Everybody got that? 